Retrospect offers different methods to remove old backup data from an existing backup set. This feature that we have is called grooming. If you go to configure and go to backup sets, you can select your backup set and go to properties and then go to options. And under options, you can select which grooming methods you want to use. The first grooming method allows you to groom or delete data based on the age of the data. So as an example, if I have 10 selected here, then it means that when my disk gets full, Retrospect will automatically delete all data except for the 10 most recent backups of each source included in that particular backup set. I can change that value to 20, and that means when my disk gets filled up, Retrospect is going to delete all the old data except for the last 20 backups for each source. And you can change it to 5 or whatever other value you want to use. The other method you have is a policy-based grooming. The policy-based grooming is more based on a time period or the age of the backup rather than a fixed number of past backups. Retrospect also has a feature called Performance Optimized Grooming or Storage Optimized Grooming. With Performance Optimized Grooming, you're going to get a much faster grooming process, but it won't save as much space on the backup media. If I choose the uh, storage-based grooming, then the groom process will be a little bit slower, but you're going to groom out more data during the grooming operations. Typically, users are going to want to take advantage of the performance-based grooming so that they have the fastest possible grooming available. 